The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the Tag Team Championship. Ladies and gentlemen, the new generation just regained the tag team titles at Vicious Valentine 6 by winning a tournament. Last defeat in the Stone family. And here they are, the new generation, Chris Idol, Justice Shadows, the two-time and current BWA Tag Team Champions. They last beat the Stone family two weeks ago to recapture those titles that were stripped from them at opening day. And they are in for a huge challenge today on Warfare as one of the greatest tag teams in our area make a special trip to the BEWA. All the way from Virginia, Robbie Wayne, Courtney Prescott. They are vanity. Two of the best technical wrestlers you'd ever want to meet. This should be a tremendous match. They got pink boas. They got awesome boots. These guys look like a team. a tag team, but these are the champions. They're looking on wondering what the hell are they looking at? Courtney Prescott's got, got something in his hand and this ring does not meet up to vanity standards. They said they will only wrestle under the best conditions and this ring is not up to their high standards. It might be good enough for teams like New Generation or the Stone Family. Courtney and Robbie only wrestle under the best circumstances and the best situations, and this, this ring is not up to their standard. A new generation, they want to wrestle, they want to fight, and these guys are just fixing the ring? So you got a team that will fight anywhere at any time, and you got a team of prima donnas that, that want everything to be perfect. Rolling Havoc looking on. Ladies and gentlemen, the Dougie Signature, the challengers to my right, the prize of Robbie Wayne and Courtney Prescott. They are the vanity. Yeah! It's just vanity. Ain't no deed in your mouth. Tag team titles they won at Vicious Valentine 6. Can't do it all, you motherfuckers. But Rowan Havoc getting this match started, this tag team title match. Now, Robbie Wayne and Courtney Prescott, they, they travel all over the place. They wrestle in all sorts of federations, and this is the first time that they're wrestling as a team as Vanity in the BWA. And their first match is for the tag team titles. Chris Idol and Robbie Wayne looking to get things started. Oh. Chris Idol goes for the handshake, but Robbie Wayne having none of it. Oh. Courtney Prescott calling a huddle. He's going to give him a handshake. Man. And the new generation, they, they're not having this shit. Oh, they've had just about enough of that. And Courtney and Robbie on the outside after that, they 
got to rethink their strategy here. Scuba Steve. Damn you, Scuba Steve. Justice Shadow inviting them back into the ring for this tag team title match, and Vanity in no kind of hurry to get this started. Six years in the BWA, and we finally witnessed a jellyfish. The old Rochambeau, scissors beat paper. They're going to do it again. Rock paper? I think paper wins that party. This is riveting shit. Hey, well, why don't you get the fuck in the ring? Chris Idol just waiting to wrestle. These two clowns just arguing about who's going to start the match. All right. Looks like Courtney's going to start things off with Chris Idol, who's been waiting patiently to get the match started. All right, man, good looking man. I won't deny that. Now, as much as these guys show off, you got to understand that Robbie Wayne and Courtney Prescott are two of the most technically sound wrestlers in the area. So, despite all these head games that they're playing, they know exactly what they're doing. They're going to see if they can get into the mind of new generation members, Justice Shadows and Chris Idol, by playing games. The theatrics that they lend themselves. Courtney seeing if uh, Chris Idol's ready. Chris Idol's been ready for about 10 minutes now. They finally lock up. Courtney forcing it into the corner. Two, three, four. And Courtney utilizing the whole uh, four to five second count that the referee affords him. Chris Idol claps it up. The crowd is dead. It's not his fault. Chris Idol puts it in the corner. Courtney alleging that Chris Idol got him by the beard hair. All right. Courtney Prescott ain't about the hair pulling bullshit. And this referee's got a huge ordeal ahead of him with these two. And Chris Idol's had about enough. He's going to send Justice Shadows in there to see if see if they can get this match finally started. Right, these two lock up. Right in front of us, right side. Oh, man. And he might have raked the eyes right there because Justice Shadows doesn't look like he can see what he's doing. Hey, sorry I'm waiting, everybody. Here to Oh, my God. What are these guys wearing? These guys, vanity, they're dressed to compete. The other guys are like scuba divers. They go to the top slam. That guy looks familiar to me. Robbie Wayne is just showing off. Wow. Look at Look at these look at these fluffy boots they're wearing. Justice Shadows doesn't look too impressed. Robbie Rain giving giving Justice Shadow the business. And hey, look at his ignorant ass pin. Oh Jesus. Well Vanity ain't playing around anymore. We got a tag. Courtney Prescott is the legal man now. Uh-oh. That doesn't look good. Stalling. Nice big suplex. That's what I do with small children on a daily. Courtney showing his strength. And this team knows where the crowd is. They're really playing them up. Nice quick tags. That's what I like to see in a tag team match. Chris Idol, I got to help us look on. It's just the shadows has been effectively isolated. Oh, God. What do you call that move? 
for a leg lock. That doesn't look good at all. Chris Idle gave him a piece of his mind. For Justice Shadows, he needs a tag. Chris Idle needs to go back to Walmart and get his couple dollars back for that shirt as well. That's nice. Get his two dollars back. Oh, he's letting him tag. He's letting him tag. And Chris Idle coming in the ring now. Justice Shadows looks like he's on Dream Street. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. Might have missed some of that on camera. Robbie Wayne was really quick in that instance. Chris Idle, he might have to tap out right now. The fucking torque and pressure Robbie Wayne has on this ankle lock. And that's one of the most creative pins you'll ever see. Chris Idle barely able to get his shoulder up. And Robbie Wayne stops dead in his tracks. Looked like he had him for a spinning, stalling brain buster or something to that effect. And Robbie Wayne is tagged out so he can have a conversation with that heckler as Courtney Prescott takes over. Wow. Wow. You thought you had a friend. He just ran him over like with a. The pressure on that gentleman's wrist, shoulder, and arm. Oh, yeah. Got to cover. He's spinning him around while the ref's covering. Okay. Chris, I was barely able to get that shoulder up. They got to do something. Tag him. Tag him. Hey, what are you doing? He's so close. This one. Courtney Prescott playing games and infuriating Justice Shadows. Oh, drove him right to the boot. Robbie Wayne tags in. And Chris Idle's in the last place he wants to be in. Just a bunch of sheet ass fruit uh... loops. Well, they didn't come up here to play by the rules. They didn't come up here to make friends. They are here to win. They are here to win championships. Did you see what he just did? He just stomped his head. It was pretty ignorant. I'm sure Chris Idol's had that treatment before. Robbie Wayne with a special shout out, and Chris Idol is screwed. <laughs> Chris Idol looks like he is dead. <laughs> Referee clearly sees. <laughs> Referee is on top of Robbie Wayne's game. Thank God we got a referee that's on top of this, because that could have been. But he is ugly as shit. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Oh, Chris Idle gave him a taste of his own medicine. Chris Idle's had enough. Courtney Prescott.
Prescott wants a timeout, but this ain't fucking football. Robbie Wayne smartly, smartly getting out of the ring and getting out of that corner. Courtney wants a timeout. Courtney Prescott wants a timeout. Justice. Justice cut him off with the pass. Big DDT, and this might have been what the new generation has been needing to take control of this match. Justice Shadow's got control of the arm. Oh, and Courtney comes in like a bat out of hell to break up that submission hold. And Robbie Wayne in excellent position to get fucked out. And Courtney Prescott has become unhinged. He is angry as fuck. <laughs> Courtney Prescott has found that second gear. He is pissed off at the world. I mean, Courtney come out to this match. He was playing games. He had a bow on. He was playing head games, but now he is just turned into an aggressive beast. Referee has got his hand full with these ruffians. Hey, come on! Break that up. He's got to get that taco meat under control. Somebody pissed Courtney Prescott the fuck off because he is not playing no games no more. Oh my. What a kick to the face. That might be the end of the match right there. If I'm Robbie Wayne. Robbie Wayne's across the ring. Robbie Wayne makes it look so easy. Makes it really easy. I think I can do it now. Well, I don't want anybody else trying that move. What a crazy match you're seeing here. Justice Shadows needs a tag. Oh, and Robbie Wayne had, had him baited the whole time. Robbie Wayne and Courtney Prescott coming up to the state of Maryland showing these tag teams everything it takes to win a match. It's not just about the physical moves. It's about being smarter, the experience that they have. Justice is snapped. Justice Shadows is snapped. He brings it back to his corner. We got a tag. Chris Idol's legal. Chris Idol's legal. Oh, big God. kick to the back. You can see the red mark already on the back of Robbie Wayne. Oh, my God. Oh. Guillotine knee drop. Chris Idol taking over this match. Remember, these tag team titles are on the line. Chris Idol backing up. Oh, jump and spin and move. And a tag. Perfectly placed kick, and Robbie Wayne is in the baddest part of the ring to be in. That might be it. Justice goes for the cover. One, two. Robbie Wayne lifts the shoulder up. Justice Shadow staying right on top of him. Referee saw the tag. Justice Shadow switches his leg off of Chris Idol's legal man now. Oh my God, that's over. It's over. Top, top.
turnbuckle, head smash, back foot. Oh, Robbie Wayne, maybe that was just instinct. Courtney Prescott, whenever he gets talking, he, oh my God, the most ignorant kick I've ever seen in my life. Do you think Vandy's, oh my God, a huge lunging spear. Courtney Prescott is showing that he's more than the flair and the pump. He is aggressive in there. And we might have new tag team champions. What, what a day it would be for Vandy if they could just walk in and walk out of here. He stopped on his foot. Chris Idol's got to do whatever it takes. Who does that? Chris Idol, that's who. Bulldog. Good bulldog, you dang it. Oh, my God. And the ref's got to get control. We got tag justice is legal. Is that it? Is that it? Justice rolls him out. And Robbie Wayne goes from the outside of the ring, leaps all the way across the ring, and breaks up that count in the nick of time. And this match continues. Justice has to stay on Prescott. Oh, this nasty submission. And Corton has got to reach the rope if he wants to continue to fight for the tag team titles. Is Justice rearing that? Oh, I think I think Courtney's biting him. I don't think the referee saw that whatsoever. Robbie Wayne back in the match. He doesn't need to know a lot of people. He's a face. He's a face. He's a face. He's supposed to get a match and then make a comeback. Oh my God. That could be it. That could be it. He's going to tap right now. We got a new tag team champions. Idol breaks up. What a nasty submission move implemented by Robbie Wayne. What? You're choking him. Hey, come on, watch this. You're choking him. Oh, and Justice has got the foot. He's got the leg. Robbie Wayne gets the rope. No help. No help whatsoever from his taxi partner, I assure you. And Justice with a nasty look at Boston Graham. With Robbie Wayne Tess. New generation will leave with the tag team title. Robbie Wayne able to get out of that maneuver, and this match continues. Chris Idol legal. Robbie Wayne legal. Headbutt. Cordy Prescott back in this match. What is it going to take to win the tag team titles? Referee's got to get control. <laughs> it's over. Oh. oh. And Courtney Press got inadvertently hit Robbie Wayne. We got to roll up. And the new generations are still champs. Still champs. Still champs. The best laid plans 
weren't enough for Vanity to come up to Maryland and steal the tag team titles. They look good for the entire match, but one miscue was all it took for the new generation to continue their winning ways and get a win over Vanity. And now, new generation can look forward to Brawl Brawl, where they will be defending their tag team titles against the Order of the Black Suns. What an incredible match that we have seen here today on Warfare. Courtney Prescott and Robbie Wayne look so tremendous, but that one slip up, that one miscue, was all that it took. Oh, it's jellyfish time. And Courtney Prescott being a poor sport. Justice Shadows just stands there and watches as his friend gets his head taken off his shoulders. Woo! Yeah! Come on say something! And Vanity may not have won the tag team titles on this day, but they have definitely put the entire BEWA locker room on notice. But the new generation standing tall in the ring still are BWA tag team champions. Warfare rolls right on. Up next, first or last, DT Gray, King XNC. Losers first man to Brawl Brawl. New generation, still your tag team champions of the world.